Okay, everybody, welcome. We're going to do a video today on a, a stove that we have and a cook pot. And in our go bag, this is one of our go bags that we have here. As you can see, it's a Swiss Army go bag, one of my several different types of bags. Uh, that's where this stove and this pot are contained. And we're going to set the stove up and we're going to make this uh, boil some water using uh, sticks inside the stove. So it's just a wood burning stove. And let's set it up and we'll be uh, we'll get right back. Okay, here's a close up of the stove. It's just a basic folding stove. Um, it has a side, a little side panel there where you put the wood in. Uh, so we're going to start our fire inside this stove, build the fire, and then we're going to put our cook pot, which is located right here, in the GSI cook pot, um, on top. And we'll get going. Okay, we're going to get our fire started today with a little bit of cotton ball soaked in uh, Vaseline, which we just extracted out of the tube with our Glock field knife. So we took a little bit out of here, <clears throat> put it up on some tinder, and we're going to light it with a <clears throat> fire steel. Let's put our knife back its case, put it off to the side here, and let's light our cotton ball. This is an Aurora fire starter, fire steel. Okay, we got our fire lit. Let's let that get going and then we'll put it inside the stove and we'll get our wood started. So we just transferred the fire into our stove, broke up some sticks that we had gathered earlier. And that's going now, and we're going to just keep feeding that until it starts burning and gets some good coals going. And then we'll open up our cook pot and add some water and show you how, show you how we boil water on this particular stove, which is a great little survival stove to have in the field. Hey guys, I want to give you a little close-up of, of our cook stove here. So, notice the little side door here that I have partially open. To let some air in. Okay, our fire is burning good inside. There's our canteen cup. There's our Glock sheath for our Glock knife. Put some paracord around it. Okay, I'm going to lift up the, the pot so you can see the fire from the top. It's just a, some nice little ashes in there going. And then I'll show you the water close up. And there you go, the water is bubbling, just about ready to boil. I put it on at 6.02 p.m. onto the fire, and it's now 6.08. So about six minutes. I didn't even make the fire that big, and uh, we're almost ready to go. Let's set the camera back up on a tripod, and we'll make our coffee. Okay, while our fire is, while our fire is going, let's take some water from our Nalgene bottle, our BPA free bottle. Let's put it in our cook pot which we've opened. We're going to make enough here for uh, something to drink just to show you how we, the water boils on the fire. Let's uh, beat some more wood into our fire. Get some more hot coals going. And then we'll be right back. Okay, there's a view of our cook pot on top of the stove. Uh, we have the lid on and we have the water boiling. And it's about uh, 70 minutes it takes, but it shouldn't take too long. Okay, everybody, we're going to give you a status update. It's been about three minutes since we had it on. Incidentally, our Glock field knife fits perfectly in this little lid. And notice we have some bubbly water already. And we have our we have our canteen cup, U.S. military canteen cup. We're going to use a instant coffee pouch out of an MRE. So we'll put that in our cup. Instant coffee, some instant creamer. This is right out of an MRE kit. Very easy, and one sugar. We're going to have us a hot drink in just a few. OK, 
Okay, everybody, our water's done. Like I said, it's 6.09 right now. We're going to take our pot cover off. Just lay it aside here. Put our knife in the sheath. Take our USGI canteen cup from canteenshop.com. Our handle on the pot is cool to the touch. We're going to add about six ounces of water to our canteen cup. Stir with our spork. And there you have it, boys. A hot cup of coffee in the field with a wood stove using material I found in my yard. Even though it rained heavy last night, I was still able to find some dry material to get this fire going. And uh, if I needed to, I could cook up a meal in here, boil some more water. So there you have it, a quick field uh, test of the very cheap, 10, 10 or $12 for this stove. You could, once it cools down, you can carry it, put it back in its fold away case, and tuck it back in my go bag, and I'm good to go. And I'm using fuel from Mother Nature. Thanks for tuning in. We look forward to your emails. Thank you for your support. God bless. Ah, one other thing. We forgot to taste our coffee. Let's taste our coffee. Ah, good, hot, creamy, and sweet. Just like I like. Take care.